Under this menu, the nut milk recipe, that's the cream of the crumb. A decadent nut milk. Le Homa, that's how we go in Cantonese. I'm Will Young from YoungManCooking.com. Welcome to the channel where you can cook with confidence. If you've been following the channel for some time, then you may have come to know that I used to run and own a nut milk business. And these nut milks were made without using any sort of thickeners, gums, or fillers, but still achieving that delicious flavor and full body texture. After running that business for some time, we were able to get that product into about 30 different retail stores and quick service. Now I don't run that business anymore and that product is no longer on the shelf. And even though I do say that I'm just some random guy on YouTube, I did learn quite a few things about making nut milks. Ever since that business, I still make nut milk at home and boy, is it ever delicious and worth the extra effort. One of the secrets really is just to have the right tools and to streamline your production. Blender. Six cups, filtered water. One and a half cups, almonds. Pinch of salt. Blend on high for two to three minutes. When I'm making nut milk at home, I try to make quite a bit of it at one time because I just love this stuff, whether it's in baking, cooking, drinking straight up, or making your favorite daily latte. Definitely helps to have a very large nut milk bag like this one. And this is actually our in-house exclusive young men cooking nut milk bag. And through our nut milk business, we've tried using different nut milk bags ranging from ones made of nylon to cotton to hemp. And we found that the highest performing one was actually the 100% organic hemp. These bags have a much stronger integral structure, which allows the liquid to be filtered. So you get an incredibly smooth texture, nut milk. Pour the mixture into the nut milk bag. Carefully squeeze out the liquid into the large bowl. You can bake or dehydrate the almond pulp into almond meal for other recipes. One thing about making almond milk at home is because there's no thickeners or fillers in the almond milk, it may not foam as well as you might expect when you go and make your favorite latte. However, there is sort of a way around that. Rinse out the blender. Quarter cup cashews. Two cups filtered water. Blend on high until liquefied, about 45 seconds. For the cashew milk, there's no need to pass it through the milk bag because the high power blender will completely liquefy the cashews. Now, if you don't have a high power blender, definitely try soaking your cashews overnight or boiling them first. Pour the cashew milk into the almond milk. Stir to combine. Glass jars. Pour the milk into the jars. This recipe makes about two liters.
I would consume these in about three to four days kept in the fridge. It is natural to see a separation as it sits in the fridge as well, but just give it a good shake and you're good to go. Now let's froth this up. Espresso machine. Pour about one cup of milk into the jug. Steam the milk until hot and frothy. Come on, look at how foamy that is. About 17 to 18 grams of freshly roasted coffee beans into the hopper to grind fresh. Damp the coffee and wipe off any excess. Double shot espresso. Mug. One tablespoon maple syrup. Espresso. Frothy steamed milk. That looks like heaven. You can now enjoy this decadent cup of coffee with absolute confidence. Nothing replaces the smell and aroma of fresh coffee. Man, that is so almost like marshmallowy how foamy that is. That is really, really amazing. I personally don't drink coffee every day, but when I do, I really, really like to enjoy a really nice cup of it with freshly roasted beans and of course, homemade nut milk. For me, drinking coffee is actually more like a decadent dessert rather than an everyday necessity. It's just so full bodied, so creamy, so aromatic. Get that touch of maple syrup that just sweetens it and livens it up. It, for me, it really is like a dessert in a cup. With this almond cashew blend, you can now turn your kitchen into a trendy cafe. Now to find out more information about the Young Man Cooking Nut Milk Bag, I'll leave a link in the description box below for you to check these out. As always, remember to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you won't miss a single episode.